Bellator Fighting Championships kicked off its fourth season Saturday night in Lemoore, California, featuring the welterweight tournament quarterfinals. In the night's main event, former Bellator welterweight champion Lyman Good battled Chris the Assassin Lozano. From the opening, neither fighter shied away from a stand-up war, with Good getting the better of the exchanges. In the second, Cyborg landed a precise hook, which caused Lozano's left eye to swell and affected his performance in the duration of the fight. In the end, the assassin would miss his target, as Lyman Good takes the unanimous decision on scores of 30-27 twice and 29-28 as he advances in the welterweight tournament. In the co-feature, heavy underdog Anthony Lapsley battled former IFL welterweight champion Jay Huron. This fight lasted just 3 minutes and 39 seconds as Huron would take the fight to the mat and sink in a rear naked choke, where referee Josh Rosenthal would declare that Lapsley was put to sleep. A visibly awake Lapsley protested the decision, which ended in controversy. The referee said break, that is it, that is the end of the fight. Lapsley is furious. We certainly didn't see a tap, but the referee disagreed, he stopped the fight. 2004 Olympic judo participant Rick Hahn showed some much improved striking over three rounds as he outpointed Rupp House student Jim Wallhead. Hahn takes the victory on scores of 30-27 and 29-28 twice as he advances to the semifinals. Opening the televised portion of the card, Brent Weedman squeaked out a unanimous decision victory against Dan Hornbuckle in a very close fight, which prompted a chorus of boos from the crowd. 